Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to some more Civ 5, where we last left off. I lost a worker. No. But, uh, we're gonna get some relations with uh, Antanavaria, whatever. And he's running away with my worker. Which is fine, I mean, I'll get, I'll get him back. I just didn't realize there was an encampment down here. Uh, next up, the Grand Temple, or Machu Picchu, or Hagia Sophia, yeah. Oh, bronze working. I need to get that. I don't need trapping. Actually, I will need trapping, so never mind. Oop. Bronze working, followed by trapping. No. I gotta go in the tech tree to do that. Bronze working, trapping. Um... Extra happiness is awesome, though. Let's go ahead and go for it, since it requires other techs. And go boom, boom, boom. better. Not good, but better. Just needs to keep on growing. And just not attack me. Wants go goes in the res- uh-oh. Okay, so I guess I'm going to have to purchase... A, uh... Guy when he gets there. I don't have the happiness to really expand much, so not much point keeping my gold. And since I'm running kind of low on gold anyway. <laughs> oh well! That's not surprising. Nice. The moon glows. Okay, so purchase the spearman. And he gets ten XP. Knowledge is power. Nice. your spices back. No? Oh, you must already be trading them.
Okay, until I get that mine done, I guess that's okay if you grow. This growth is going to be an issue with you. I'm like in a city location here eventually too, but I just need happiness. And that's the quickest one. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna bait him. Yep. Way more damage. And then they'll move back, and I'll be able to finish them off and get them. Unless, of course, the scout goes in there and bees a dumb. Which she didn't do, so it's okay. How did you not want me to take that out? Seriously. They want me to get actual gold. Literal gold, not the currency. Because I want a city here. I think it's better to have a city on this side of it. Get over here and fix that. Oh, jeez. Well, assuming they range and kill it, they won't be able to take it. Four turns. Yeah, I can go ahead and keep working this then. Ouch, that horseman could hurt. Oh, I stayed alive. No one's built the pyramids yet? <laughs> Go for the pyramids. I want two workers. Well, I want a worker. A worker is five turns. So I get two workers, and then everyone else works really good if I had two extra turns. Uh, so I could go down piety. That's something I could do. I could go down aesthetics. Let's finish up liberty. Then I can get me a stuff. 
A stuffs. Uh, build a monument. Pretty person we want a great scientist. And I'm gonna throw him out over here. Is iron. That's the only iron on the map. Is this two iron right here? So I can't go with iron. So I'm not, like militarily, I'm screwed until we get the muskets. Pretty much. Why does he do this? Like, seriously. Well, that's not surprising. As soon as I get the cities that I want out, I'll go for him. Because he does have resources. He has gold! Good a reason as any to go to war. So the issue here, wow, so even with that luxury resource, I'm still really low. And I'm going to get to zero here in a second because I'm losing their friendship. Gold is an issue. Oh, I just realized there's an encampment over here. That's no good. Excellent. Jeez, well, we know which branch they're going down. Faraway land. I can deal with the faraway land. We're going to have you come down here and you'll be there before they're done. That four food is knocking down 60 turns. Okay, so I could go down Piety and eventually get this stuff here, but I think Aesthetics is, well, the boost in culture is great. Um, go for Tradition. No, we're going to go down Piety. Uh, probably get Mandate of Heaven.
Oh my gosh, what? They moved there and took it? Great. Someone's in the medieval era, eh? Holy cow, archers galore. Oh, just doing stuff down here. So I say it's taking too long. All of them are hitting me, huh? That's way too much damage. I'm not up for losing another unit. I know, and there's not much I can do about it. He's working literally every tile he can. Okay. That one would have been good for me with my ability, but I'm not really... Given this start, that it's, it's so economical, and given that... You know, this guy's not a threat. The only guy that's a threat is there's a buffer between us and that I want to get good cities out first. Like, there isn't any particular reason for me to be too warmongery at this point. Oh, finish it. Get in a stagnant. Good. So I don't lose any pop. That's the big thing. The evil era, so they're getting there. So I need to be happy, and I need gold.
Okay. Kind of religion. Um. Sure. Actually, it'd be better. There we go. <laughs> oh, I should have done that. In the multiplayer, but I was tired. So we need money, so tithe is always good. Pagodas and Moss are the only two left. They're both good. I definitely want one of them. But in all honesty, I have I have a decent number of wonders. Now there's two faith. That'll probably double my faith. Let's get let's do that. Double my faith perfectly. Half the time I need to get there, chances are I will still be able to get one of them. And if not, then oh well. Yeah, the food food will also help. Nope, this is where we want to stop it. I want 45, but oh, it's 146. Turn 146, uh, that was my, there it is. So we're actually 10th placed in literacy, which is technically last place. But I think that makes perfect sense because I don't have sailing, I don't have all of these like lower techs. I've been going primarily for the higher ones. And it's, I think, over the high street. Yeah, I like that idea. So anyway, thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.